Greetings, Internet, and Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, Happy whatever you celebrate, and welcome to another episode of Insane Ian Eats Things He Shouldn't! Yeah, so, uh, I'm filming this before Christmas, but you're not seeing this until the day after Christmas, probably. Uh, unless you're part of my Patreon, where you can see these videos ahead of time. Ha! Ah, shameless plug. Anyway, we're looking at some festive holiday candies uh, that I managed to pick up. We've got Cherry Hershey's Kisses, which uh, I guess are just Hershey Kisses with cherry in the middle. We've got Hot Cocoa Hershey Kisses, which have marshmallow in the middle. Yes. Sweet Cinnamon Kit Kats. I'm very excited about these. And something a little special. We have Kit Kat Everyday Cranberry and Nut Ruby. It's a very weird long name. Doesn't say it anywhere on the front other than ruby chocolate. Whatever ruby and chocolate means, but there's... It's cranberries and nuts in a Kit Kat, apparently. And it's called Kit Kat Everyday Nuts and Cranberry Ruby. I, I got this at Box Lunch, which you can see the bag for over there. During their holiday sale, you bought two get one free thing, and this was my free thing. So I was like, ooh, yeah, Kit Kats, I'll try that. It's in a little zipper pouch. It's very Japanese, and that was what the translation was on the back, so you can see the ingredients and stuff. Have a break, have a Kit Kat. It's uh, cranberries and nuts in these little tiny, weird little ruby wafer things. So we're gonna try these first, because I'm excited for new things. And also I love Kit Kats. We're gonna begin and end with Kit Kats, I think. We're beginning with this, because I'm holding it. And we're gonna end with the sweet cinnamon ones, because reasons. Here's a funny thing. I went out and I bought the Cherry Kisses, and the Kit Kats, and then the next day my girlfriend went out and bought the Cocoa Kisses and another bag of Kit Kats, not knowing I had bought them already. So I have two bags of these things in my house. I'm very happy about that. Uh, well, we'll see if I'm gonna be happy when I eat them. I'm probably gonna be happy. But anyway, this. These are just, these are just weird. They're weirdly shaped. They're little cubes which you don't associate with Kit Kats, you think the long wafer thing. And they're, they're cranberries and nuts, so... And it's got a, definitely got a cranberry scent on it, because there's cranberries in it, so I guess that would be why. That's really nice. I didn't expect the crunch, because for whatever reason, even though they're Kit Kats, I kind of expected there not to be the wafer in there, but the wafer is in there. But these are really nice, there's not a whole lot of them in there. But for, you know, a tiny package, it's got like seven of them in there. That's not bad. There are these uh, little dried cranberries, little little bit of nuts, and um, wafer, and the chocolate is almost yogurt-like. It's really good. I like that. It's very sweet. I really like that. Next, we're moving on to the Hershey's Kisses Hot Cocoa. This appears to already have been opened. My girlfriend bought these for herself, and uh, I'm, I'm going to try a couple, obviously. They were hers. <laughs> <laughs> and she already tried them. But Hershey's Kisses, cocoa flavored with the little, little marshmallow in there. It's very yummy. It's very neat looking. I like Hershey's Kisses. It's a very Christmas kind of treat. Yeah, I kind of associate Hershey's Kisses with, with the Christmas holiday. I think probably because of that uh, Carol of the Bells they did with the, uh, oh no, it was We Wish You a Merry Christmas, but they did it with the, like the hand bells. Just smells like a Hershey's Kiss. We're gonna do a cross section. Oh yeah. Marshmallow filling. <laughs> that's really tasty. Mm. So yeah, that's a hot cocoa one. The chocolate and the marshmallow together. It's great. How can you not like it? Do you not like marshmallow? Are you crazy? Obviously I am occasionally. It's just an occupational hazard. But no, these are, these are delicious. Milk chocolate with marshmallow flavored cream. It's great. No, it's perfect. Moving on to the milk chocolate filled with a cherry cordial cream. The cherry Hershey's Kisses. These are gonna be pretty fun as well. Assuming I can get into them. I was lucky that that one was already open. Same deal. Oh no! I dropped one. But they're the same deal. Only they've got the shiny red packaging. It's all swirly and pretty. And these are just, you know, your Hershey's Kisses with a cherry cordial cream. Not an actual cherry in the middle, but, you know, cherry cordial flavored cream. Just like not actual marshmallow in the cocoa ones, just marshmallow flavored cream. But uh, that's a, that's a, Hershey's Kiss, like any other, but that's a gooey cherry cream. I don't know why I said gooey like that. Oh, but it's tasty. Mmm, oh. so sweet and delicious. I get fat at the holidays. Ah, mm. See, this is why uh, diets don't count during holidays, 
is because you have all of this delicious stuff. And this is also why this video doesn't go live for everybody else until after Christmas, because that's when the discount on candy is. It's like Halloween. It's like the day after Halloween, all the candy's discounted. Same thing with Christmas, kids. Important safety tip for me to you. Finally, we have the sweet cinnamon Kit Kats. I have two bags of these. Did I mention that? I'm very excited. Crisp wafers in sweet cinnamon flavored milk chocolate. Naturally flavored with other natural flavors. Okay. And just like the, the pumpkin pie ones we had previously, they got little faces on the on the wrappers. Just little happy, festive Kit Kat sticks, I guess. He's got a little, little cinnamon roll there. A little cinnamon roll. Whatever. I'm gonna eat his face. Oh, wow. I didn't even stick my face in this bag and this waft of cinnamon just punched me in the nose. Oh, man. I, there should be smell vision occasionally for instances like this because it is a strong and powerful cinnamon smell. Holy crap. Oh, that's so festive. <laughs> Look at the little faces. <laughs> I might be a little sugared up. I can't tell. But we're going to put one of these in my face hole where the food goes because that's how stuff does. I'm sorry. I, I want to take this moment to apologize. I'm sorry for all of that. Whatever the hell that was. I don't eat a lot of sugar anymore, and this is why. Because when I do have it, I go freaking crazy! Um, peek the microphone. Sorry. We're gonna eat this. It's gonna be tasty, and I'm gonna enjoy it. I have two bags of it. I'm very excited. I don't know if I mentioned that. So it's a Kit Kat that smells like it came out of Cinnamon's butthole. Good God. It is such a strong, strong cinnamon smell. Holy crap! Man, like, that's extreme. Like, that's almost overpowering how cinnamony that smells. Wow! We're gonna try it. It's gonna be tasty. So here's a weird thing. It smells more like cinnamon than it tastes like cinnamon. There's a hint of cinnamon taste, yeah. It's definitely there. But it's not as overpowering as the cinnamon smell is. I'm not arguing, I'm not complaining. It's definitely delicious. And I definitely do taste the cinnamon. It's just not as strong as you'd expect it to be when you smell it. But I don't care. It's Kit Kats. I'm going to eat them all. It's so good. Yeah. Very strong cinnamon smell. Traditional great Kit Kat flavor. Oh, it's wonderful. Well, at the end of this episode, I'm gonna keep stuff in my face, and I'll go on a diet after the new year. Happy holidays, everybody! Bye! <laughs> they're still wrapped. And now they're everywhere. My girlfriend's gonna kill me. I'm not crazy about peppermint. Uh -uh. I'm not crazy about PBJ. No way. But if you stick it in a cookie form, uh -huh. you know I'ma eat it anyway. Oh yeah. So come on. You can give me anything that you want. Anything that you want. Give me anything that you want. You can give me anything that you want. Anything that you want.